starting. Hello, everybody. It's time for more 13 Sentinels. It's been a bit. Uh, boop. And then I screen share. Eh, I hate that even when I'm clicked out, like, if I don't remember to click out of the VTube Studio window, my scrolling does just make me smaller. Yeah, I mean, I, I imagine there's probably a way to... It, there's, it's good for most things, probably, but for me in particular, it's very annoying, because I forget a lot. Uh, there you go. Oops, that quality is up too high. It's going to cause problems for me. But... Okay. All right, let's go. I just tried to click into my PlayStation window, which is not how any of that works. Okay. Where are we at? What can I remember? I know, man. Locked. Yes. Oh, yeah, this one's unlocked. Haven't done that yet. Ah, I did unlock this one. Right, he was stuck in a time loop. That's right, I remember that now. I have ten mystery files. I can resume hers. Okay, haven't done that. Alright, who should we... Let's figure out what this fucking guy's deal is. I don't trust this bitch. This guy's been sus as fuck. Final battle, a few weeks earlier. Sakura High School Science Room. They should really have- they should really lock this what door. Do doing, they really shouldn't have windows. I believe I told you using the gate is prohibited. Oh, am I moving now? Okay. Tell me, Miss Morimura. Is history one of your better subjects? <sighs> I have some theories myself. I'd like to know if they're accurate. For example, the true location of the lost nation of Yamatai Koku. I've never heard of that. And the truth behind the Hanoji incident. How Oda Nobunaga really died. Unfortunately, my paper in middle school was bound to the failures of our historians. In theory, I could update it into a full report. In theory. Well, I mean, you can only go forward or backward 40 years at a time. To so. <laughs> what are you really working towards? It's simple. I want to know the truth. Is there anything else in here? Fucking his his run cycle looks really aggressive. Yeah. You got that lean going. Excuse me. Are you alright? This isn't like you. That implies an understanding of what is like me. Oh, okay. Oh my or god. <laughs> Shut up. That you believe you understand me. That's not the point. You need to stop using the gate. I'm going to seal this place off. Oh yeah? <laughs> Sounds like you've got something to hide. I don't know what you're... Wait. Perhaps a personal notebook seems a bit archaic, but it does present certain advantages. Digitized data can be altered. Fabricated. Falsified. No intelligent person should trust it. But you already know that, don't you? You are acting strange, after all. I hardly think you're in a position to talk. If anyone's changed, it's you. I can only wonder why. What are you? Miss Morimura, my question is, who exactly are you? What do you what do you what, what do you what do you want to know, fuck boy? Hmm? Morimura, shortly after meeting. So, did the scout unit have anything for us? Well, the surface is a total loss. The automated factories are all running at full capacity. Well, that's not good. They're mass producing kaiju. Oh, it's me. I'm alive. Yeah. Didn't we see this room before? Yeah, we've been in here. Last time we were in here was when um, Glasses Girl was in here with future Amaguchi, I think, and she was like this robot. 
something like that. Uh, hey, so I think this is in the future. Everything. The technology itself isn't so different from 40 years ago. The real surprise was finding that it's all been integrated into one unified system. You sure don't seem like someone from your time. What does that mean? How are things looking? About like we expected. Naturally. All the nuclear plants are stable. Naturally. Seems like it's the same for other Naturally. countries too. Naturally. Defensive measures. They want to ensure nothing interrupts production. Automated factory. So, these factories, are they particularly large? It's more about how they got totally automated. That was back in 2080. They started functioning as part of a network instead of individual units. So yeah, we're in 21 whatever right now. 1.2 billion factories, all fully integrated and synchronized. Based on a client's request, the computer designs a blueprint. From there on, oh my god, automated. that's te that's a terrible idea. Assembly, production, even cost-effective ordering of parts. The human element was no longer necessary for those processes. Oh my god. <laughs> so it's a manufactory that can mass produce anything on a global scale. And somebody ordered it to make killer robots. My god. They all function as part of a unified global manufacturing network. By its protocols, all 1.2 billion factories will That's a lot of factories. perpetual production. And their sole output are these mechanized kaiju, which we know as the D-forces. <laughs> the what? The deforces. The deforces, yes. We checked on the plants in Kolkata and Chennai. Since they're the largest plants of this era and all, their production rate has doubled over the last three days. That seems Just bad. Like last time. The timing matches up too. Not long now. They'll make their move soon. Morimura san, regarding my home time, that is the year 2064. Okay, so yeah, they're all from, like, different times. How did they all... How and why did they all end up in, like, the 80s and 60s? You're certain we'll face a similar or attack. Or 40s, I guess. We don't have long until they appear in 2064. That much we know. It'll be just like last time. No, not quite. This time, we have the Sentinels. True. Anything on your end? Loosely speaking. We managed a partial data dump from the underground mainframe. Goto-kun? It's an archived news report concerning a certain scandal. More important, though, is its date of recording. When's the data from? The year 2188. In other words, far in the future. Even more so than our current temporal position, 2104. Let's see it. Future scandal has been added to the thought cloud. Sick. Let's go. Future scandal. Use future scandal on computer. Before dawn on the 20th, eight Newman Inc. executives were taken into police custody, charged with human trafficking and illegal cloning. Their established motive was to tamper with human memories. Authorities consider this an organized effort and are pursuing further charges. Mind hacking crimes have been on the rise in recent years. Mind hacking crimes. By exploiting nanomachines such as interlocitors, Malefactors can overwrite stored memory information in cerebral synapses. This technique has recently been used to enable other associated offenses. These arrests come after a string of similar cases, including culprits criminally downloading memories onto another body. Evidence suggests these are attempts at a kind of technological reincarnation, and we've already seen more than 460 arrests connected That's to this quite a practice. few. A log concerning the scandal involving Newman Inc. The report is dated 2188. Some of their executives were taken into police custody. The crime in question was apparently attempting to use nanotechnology to, in theory, take over physical bodies. Right. So that explains some of the, like, memory bullshit we've been encountering. Probably. I didn't know it was even possible to download... And I'm pretty sure memories. the magic gun that fucking the cat is having us use on people is nanomachine related. <laughs> Yeah, probably. The crime apparently occurred in June of 2188. Itakun. That's not all. Let him finish. Let him cook. Regarding this Newman, I found one more log that could be relevant. This report is from March, about three months prior to the other log. Future merger. Newman Inc., the 
tech giant known for inner lossiters has been acquired by Shikishima through a takeover bid. Oh. Shikishima's CEO had this to say. Nanotechnology has made leaps and bounds over the 22nd century. Now, even the human body can operate with all the power of a supercomputer. Inner Lossiters have paved the way for humanity's next step in evolution. For any one of us, all it takes is a thought, and we can have the world itself at our fingertips. With the brilliant minds at Newman driving... I don't know that I would want nano machines listening to every thought I have. We look forward to no, the they're gonna... <laughs> There's some bad gonna, thoughts in gonna, there. Gonna, he's gonna tell the fucking cops. <laughs> They're going to arrest me for thought crimes. Shikishima now sits among the top three in global market share of interlocutors. Three months prior to the Newman Inc. incident, Newman was acquired by the conglomerate Shikishima. Right. With these interlocutors, apparently some kind of nanomachine information technology, they've become one of the world's top megacorps. They kept mm. talking about those interlocutors. You think that's the nano machines inside our own bodies? Most likely. Nano machines, son. They harden in response to physical trauma. So Shikishima's at the heart of this too. At least we know we weren't wrong. This all began in the future after all. Still. Yeah. 2188. 2104 is the furthest we can shift into the future. It's a shame, but I don't think we can verify this ourselves. I think we should drop this lead for now. Better to focus on protecting Godokun's hometown instead. Maybe so. <coughs> We're almost out of time, so we'll need to move quickly. Best to return to the school in the year 2064. We'll need the cooperation of the other two compatibles. Gotokun, we should focus on putting the Sentinels through the combat sims. I hope you can join me. Sure. Hmm. The plot thickens. Final battle a few weeks earlier. My apologies, Miss Morimura. Ah, she's pretending to be a child again, I guess. Making arrangements in 1985 proved somewhat difficult. I'm sorry we've had to remain here the past few days. Not much we can do if it's an emergency. I have to ask, was it absolutely necessary to dress me up like this? Does it bother you? Considering the age you appear, well, it struck me as the most inconspicuous choice. I still don't know what her whole deal is because we met this child in the 60s or the 40s even. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'm not allowed to go that way. You're not having trouble walking, are you, Miss Morimura? You should probably just call me Chihiro. Otherwise, we'll seem suspicious in public. <laughs> okay, Chihiro. The sun. Better drop the sun, too. Oh, come on. Honestly, I'm surprised you were able to find me at all. A certain data log helped. I found records that your mind had been transferred. Ah. Into the young child standing before me. Ah. This body is a juvenile clone of me. Huh? I ran an experiment to see if I could restore my compatibility. It turned out to be a failure. That's why I sealed my memories. Huh? Come again? This compatibility. That'd be the ability to control the gate and the sentinels. You need compatibility to control the mainframe. I was once compatible myself, but after everything got rewound, I lost that power. Maybe it's hard for you to see how crucial that ability is, but you'll understand soon enough. Hmm. <coughs> this refers to the humans who can control the UFO's mainframe. Those compatible have nano machines implanted in their bodies. Right. What's going on with my actual body? She's acting like a completely different person. My theory is that someone's taken control of her. You're saying she got mind hacked? She's clearly behaving very differently, at least. It seems like she's working against the Sentinel Project. It's like she's been influenced by 426. Or the man himself may just be wearing her face. That certainly explains why you woke me up. <sighs> Not much to go on, though. Either way, we'll have to do some more investigation. I can see it's been quite a while since my memories were sealed. Five whole years. And now four sectors have gone dark. Talk about a rude awakening. First, mm. you'd better catch me up on major developments in the last five years. Easy enough. 
Hardly comfortable surroundings for a briefing, though. I'll explain over in 1985. <laughs> it sucks. It <laughs> yeah, sucks let's here. Let's just go back <laughs> a few more weeks earlier. UFO mainframe. We're going backwards. That's weird. Now, let's see if the biometric authentication works. I hope he just gets fucking evaporated. Did it go through? I don't know. Did it? I don't. I'm not 100% sure what you're trying to do. Looks like that got me past the initial barrier, at least. Now, with Miss Murimura's ID, I should be able to get into her logs. Ah, and this is how he was able to find the kid. the log she left behind experiment log today's date is march 2nd 2100 well i guess there's no point in putting a date to these logs they've probably got four years left until the invasion begins i ran an experiment on my clone i wanted to see if i could make her more compatible i had more than enough data stored in sector zero she would have had all my memories however i could not establish compatibility in the clone no more than I could in myself. Maybe there really is no way we can survive this. Not even Ida Kun knows about this experiment. I've kept or this do I? For everyone. The memories I implanted in the clone have been sealed. I left her in 1940 under the Miura family's care. Yeah. She'll be able to grow up as her own person. Someone separate from me. Until they invade, at least. That methodology sounds familiar. Was she basing this project off of those memory overriding crime reports? All in an effort to achieve compatibility? So compatibility isn't just a matter of differences in the nanomachines. Interesting. There's more. This file looks like the last thing recorded. I hope it's just, ah, explosion. I mean, it's already fucked either way, so we might as well. Yeah, that's the thing, might right? Well. Like, they've, they've tried this time loop thing a few times, and it seems like it's going nowhere. So, like, trying something different at that point is really the better option, isn't it? Trying the same thing over and over, expecting a different result is the definition of insanity. I learned that from Far Cry 3. Yeah. Operation Aegis. Ever since the battle that ended with the Sentinels infected, Miss Morimura has been pushing this operation as one of its fiercest supporters. The final log that Chihiro Morimura left on the UFO. She speaks at length on Operation Aegis. Her goal is that he and she would ultimately survive, even at the cost of humanity's future. The question is, who is he? Is there more? That's puzzling there's a log registered under my name as far as i know i've never recorded anything like this well Renya Goto speaking. ah <laughs> oh. you know you know i thought maybe did you confirm receipt of payment and i'm sure you can see to the details am i clear i want her dead any means necessary execute her and stop the project. Hmm. That's not my problem. It's in your hands now. Do you realize what'll happen if her project gets approved? It could ruin everything we've worked for. You know what must be done. Kill Chihiro Morimura. Hmm. Was that really me? That man was a Shikishima executive from the year 2188. Is that supposed to be my future? Seems like a private communications log. The other person on the line wasn't recorded. But it's clear enough what they're talking about. <laughs> that was an assassination order on Shihiro Morimura. Yeah. Yes. Which I seem to have called in. Goto's prologue cleared. 
Protagonist with story progress at 80% or over. 12. Currently at zero. Oh. So this one requires us to get to, like, mostly finish all of the other routes before it unlocks. Yeah. All right. What's your deal, Mr. F Mr. World War II? Hat guy. <laughs> Hat guy. May 1985. Clear skies. Monitoring the Sentinel from Kaede River. The sunset is always the same. I met Natsuna-san over at the shrine. She ended up dodging my question. What was she doing there? She attends the same school as Juro-kun. At least that's what he told me. Hmm. Time travel. Stuffed rabbit. Stuffed rabbit. That's the sentinel still. Nothing's changed today either. They just put up some big tents around it. I need to figure out how to take back the Sentinel. Then I can find a way to return to 1945. Though, I can't seem to reactivate it. I've tried countless times, too. I hope I didn't break it. If there's a mechanical issue, I'd love to take a look at it. But security around the building's been tight lately. Now I can't get too close. I can't just sit here. Actually, that factory at the mountain pass may have survived the air raid. It might still be standing in this era. It's been 40 years, man. Like, even if it is still standing, that doesn't mean it's in operation. 1600 hours, heading to the factory at Ayame Pass. Former factory site. Well, I guess that answers that, doesn't it? Before the war, the story of it only to think... Which thing of these is new? I saw when the wars of August, if that's true. Then Japan loses the war in just three months. Yeah, man. It wasn't good. <laughs> Park. Examine. Ayame Park. This is where the factory used to be. Ah. Chihiro, what are you doing here? And which version are you? Chihiro? Is it really you? What business do you have with my little sister? Who are you? I'm that child's older brother. Is there something you need from her? No. She just... looks like a relative of mine. Mm. Hmm. Let's get going. Odd. Shihiro, if she's still alive, she'd be over 40 by now. If she's... We don't have a family burial plot where I'd find her. I have no idea what's happened to her. She's either alive somewhere in this world, or... Shihiro, or dead, I guess. Those I'm are the two options. <laughs> she's either alive or dead, that's true. He's not wrong. Oh, can't follow them. What's that? In any case, oh, no, it's a I bucket. should go talk to Natsuno-san. She must know something. Go look for Natsuno Minami. Sunset, visiting my alma mater in Sakura Ward. Sakura High School. It looks nothing like the school I attended. Well, it's been 40 years, I would hope so. Natsuno-san, get it together, Keitaro. She certainly is quite... Yes, I admit, she's bright, cheerful, attractive. Uh-huh. But right now, I have more urgent matters to tend to. Oh, that wasn't even the one. If she's... I have no... She's... Yeah. Evil. Okay, okay, that was the one. Enter the school grounds. It's, each one of these makes me think there's an option somewhere, and I'm curious to see where the branches are it's when we get that here. far. It's been renovated, but I do recognize this building. Yeah, it's the old school building, I think. If this is the school building, then over there's where the potato field used to be. Looks like that plot of land got bigger. I wonder if there's a way in. 
the door. Enter the old school building. Like, is there a nah, I give up option for each of these? What's happening? Of course there isn't, dog. It's abandoned. This building was brand new. Now the floorboards creak. The yeah, it's old. Scratched up. And really has been 40 years. Yeah, man. Whoa. I'm fucking seeing ghosts. This is where I waited for Takatoshi-san, and where Tamao-san came to see me off. How strange. It almost feels like it was all just a distant dream. All right, enough. This isn't the time to be getting sentimental. What time is it, then? Is there anything else in here? No, not really. Cat. Hey. Oh, hello. Oh, Mira hey, straight Homura. Megumi-san, thank you again for the bento oh, kitty you leaves. Me. I found a nice spot to eat it by the Kaide River. A bento with meatballs. Quite luxurious. I was very impressed. Oh. They were just regular old meatballs. Nothing special. But I'm glad you liked it. What are you doing out here? Are you looking for someone? Maybe. I'm looking for... I'm looking for American weapons. I'm trying to find Natsuno-san. Would you happen to know where she is? Minami-san? She should be in the track room. The athletic building's over that way. Want me to go check? No, that's okay. Oh, yeah. So for dinner tonight, I think I'll make Hamburg steak. You seem to really like it. You mean that giant ball of meat? Hamburger meat, yeah. Hamburger. It's <laughs> Jiro's favorite. So try not to come home too late. <laughs> Ham Hamburger. <laughs> <laughs> hamburger. Those meatballs they call hamburger. <laughs> I've never had anything so delicious. <laughs> Enough. This is no time to be distracted by food. Hamburger. No, it is. <laughs> hamburger. Sorry, just listening to him say hamburger is really funny. Not hamburger. So hamburger. Hamburger. That's the best one of those we've gotten so far. Stack of Hamburger. Stack of Hamburger. Everyone's staring at me. I'm glad I found Natsuno-san. But I don't like all this attention. Are they? Hey, you. What? Hi. You've been standing there an awfully long time. What are you doing? I'm waiting for Natsuno Minami. Minami? How do you know her? And how old are you? Looks like a middle school uniform to me. No, uh, I'm, uh... Seriously? You guys have to be so nosy. Not so, son. Come on, let's go. Okay, bye. Sorry. We, let's changed. go to five, five feet away. It's fine. They're off I screen. I'd wait. So, whenever you exercise, you all change into outfits that show your legs? That's... Fascinating. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, you kind of showed up at school out of nowhere. Everything okay? Hamburger. Ah, uh, there it is. Hamburger. Hamburger. Uh, what am I supposed to ask about? Time travel. Natsuno san, I met you before. Back in 1945. And now here you are. Huh? You must know something about all this. About how I ended up in this era. Please, tell me what you know. That's, uh, jeez. How do I put this? Classified? <laughs> Robot. Look, I can't really talk about it here. American weapons. Yeah. <laughs> 
could go to the building I used back in my time. It seemed to be empty. The old school building? We can go in there? Yes. I mean, it's not it locked. Alright. Then we'll talk about it there. Let's go. I always thought this place would be locked up. We should be good here. I think this is the first time we've actually seen her in the school uniform. Yeah? Norokun, can you keep a secret? Uh, of course. Okay. <laughs> then I'll tell you. Don't freak out, okay? I've got a cool robot friend. This is BJ. He's an BJ. alien in the future. <laughs> I love that she's just wrong about that. <laughs> BJ's looking for the robot he used to get here, and I'm helping him find it. A uh, robot? Does the word sentinel ring a bell? <laughs> that sentinel from back in 1945 belongs to BJ's alien friend. There are a few of them, too. How does she know about the sentinel? And did she say it was made by aliens? It's a top secret military weapon created by Japan. I don't need to tell you this. But those babies are capable of time travel. <laughs> Alright, any of the rest of this relevant? No, okay. This BJ. I have some questions about it. <laughs> I've heard Shikishima engineers talk about something like this. Sorry. Isn't this actually a type of scout unit? Shikishima? They don't dabble in alien technology. All they do is make weapons, and BJ is no weapon. But... Chikaro. Miura. If he's just a scout unit, explain how he can talk. What? Fuck do you what mean? What does that mean? What do you mean by that? I what? don't see your correlation BJ here. <laughs> BJ isn't some kind of robot. This is just... A yes, he is! Look at how him! How are you this dumb? Shapes and sizes. My guess is, the only thing inside that suit is BJ's brain. You literally just... I love that she's just wrong. It's so good. <laughs> she just made a bunch of assumptions based on nothing. I don't care who's responsible for creating the Sentinel. I need it to save my country. But what do I do? I mean, your country seems fine. TBH. The circuit should have repaired itself by now. But I can't seem to reactivate it. Oh, is he one of the people that got shot? I think he is. Isn't that why he has the thing? Why he wears his hat like that to cover up his forehead shit? Well, no, he's got a forehead scar from something else, I think. But, like, I think... I think uh, Straight Homer shot him, so maybe that's why he can't reactivate the robot. Because of the nano machines and the, and the magic gun, you know. This is all sensible things we're talking about. Why are you searching for the Sentinel? What's your objective? To uncover the truth. Oh. The truth? You wish to know where you came from, do you not? What are you talking about? I came from 1945. Incorrect. Your log proves otherwise. My log? Yeah, show us. Show us your log. Babe, you can't just <laughs> ask people to show them your their log. If you really have it, I'd like to see it. <laughs> Professor, I have switched over to a private channel. Professor Takamiya, can you hear me? Is that... Your account? Professor Takamiya. I'm connected now. Hey, it's Punk Girl. Thanks, mira -kun. What the heck? Yuki-chan? Everything goes smoothly with the shuttle? I was able to secure a seat thanks to you. It'll probably be the last shuttle. This place will be lost by tomorrow, too. Has the front line advanced that much already? Afraid so. If anything, they're picking up speed. Did Natsuno get out safely? She arrived in Sector 4 about five hours ago. Ah, oh, so she's there with you. You know, you two. I never approved of your relationship. What? <laughs> Mom? Mom? <laughs> Whoa, what? There's oh. <laughs> you know I'm only kidding. I didn't think you wanted to talk to me anymore. Are they all from the future? Of course I do. I'm sorry about all the trouble with your father. 
He and I haven't been on good terms since we split up. It's okay, Mom. Who's the father? Is it Nenji? Tell me it's I Nenji. Know. I want nothing more on Earth. Me too, Nachan. Yuki-chan's my mom? I'm sorry, Professor Takamiya. The shuttle's about to take off. All right. I'll see you at Sector 3 in 14 hours. We'll be waiting for you at Landing Zone 10. Looking forward to it. The destruction is spreading. It's only a matter of time until the surface is lost. What the heck was all that? Uh, yeah, what the fuck? That's a lot of shit right there, dude. I have to know. When was that log recorded? In the year 2188. Yeah. That doesn't make sense. How is this even possible? Yuki-chan's my mom in the future? I mean, when you put it like that, it sounds insane. Fifty percent. Hey. What if I if I can? How do I look at that timeline? Man, we haven't got to talk to this fucker in forever. Victims of poison. We got to do victims of poison, whatever that is. May 1985, clear skies. Is there a route I missed here? There must be, because it's taking me back to the same spot. How do I... Where's the route button? Oh, wow, there's a whole bunch of shit we didn't do that we could do. Yeah. Can you mouse over them? Okay, Okay, so you got one of them. I can do this Natsuno. one. Natsume. Natsume. This one I need Renya, Goto. And then this one I can't seem to do yet. No matter where I... Okay, so if I... She's from... She seems to know about the existence of other Sentinels. Is that how she's able to travel through time? Maybe there's another way. In any case, she appears to be a central figure in all this. So do you. Could she still be at school? Go to school. Okay, so let me see. That scout unit is in at least the footage he showed us. If it's real, all I know for she left. She's leaving, right? There's something else that happens here. Can you over listen? Oh, this is okay. So I am on a new route. You're you're on the route. Hey. Megumi-san. The cat's like, oh shit, bye. Yes. Oh, right. No. I see. Maybe he went home already. For dinner tonight, what should I make? Hamburger. We could have hamburger. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Again? No, no, that's all right. I'm fine with anything. Well, let's see. We've had nothing but meat these last few days. I think I want to make some fish for Juro. Okay. That's me. Fish is me. Don't I'll listen to Christians. They're wrong. <laughs> That's Catholics. Catholics. They're wrong. Okay. Can I do anything else around here? We could have a hamburger. In the athletics building. This can't possibly just take me back to the Aha! Woman with bandages. Bandage girl. You again. She fucking she gone. She was here a second ago and now she isn't. Not you again, me. I'm still on new route, right? Yes. Where'd she go? Bandage drugs girl was here a second ago. Minami isn't here today. Must have been really important. She even ditched practice. Is that so? Hey, are you Minami-san's boyfriend? How far have you two gone? What? Jesus no. Christ. Wow. You've got it all wrong. Do you happen to know where she Ah! Went? She hid behind there Pillar! She, there she is. Well, she Genius! She was in a hurry. 
But I don't know where she went. I know where. She went over to Tokisaka Shrine. What's she doing there? Not sure. I didn't ask. I fucking saw you back there, bitch. I know you're here. Tokisaka Shrine, huh? That's where I first met her. But it was back in my own era. Go to the shrine. I fucking- I can see part of- Ah, she follow! She spy. The shrine's hardly changed at all. The surrounding thicket, on the other hand, that has changed considerably. It's buildings now. Can't believe those trees changed into apartment complexes. Crazy. That's that's just standard evolution, man. I don't see Natsuno san anywhere. I wonder if she's hiding behind the trees again. What I'd give to see that. What? <laughs> Hi. No luck. We couldn't find it. I wonder where it could be. Natsuno san. Whoa. Hi. Hello. Hey, bud. Whoa. Hey. Uh, what are you doing out so late? And why are you here of all places? Natsuno san. What was that just now? Time travel. There was a big flash of light and you just appeared. Just like when I came to this era and my sentinel. Same flash of light and everything. Time travel. I, uh... Come to think of it, this happened at the shrine back when we first met, too. There was a similar flash, almost like lightning. I get it now. You have to come here to travel through time. What do we do, BJ? Please, tell me what's going on. I just want to go home. No. <laughs> Are you just going to leave your sentinels behind? Oh yeah, that's how you got here. What are you going to do with it? It's <laughs> a good point. American weapons. I'll figure out how to deal with the sentinel later. It's Shihiro, my little sister. If there's any chance she made it out of that hell alive, then I have to find out. Hmm. Okay, that makes sense. BJ, think you can make it happen? No. <laughs> Time travel to 1945. Please. Hi. Activate That fine sounded very fucking... Fine. Fine. <laughs> Now Bandage Girl saw that, I assume. Yup. That data unit. So it was with Natsuno Minami all this time. 1945, Tokisaka Shrine. Are we back? I mean, you tell me, man. Is it really that easy to travel through time? I don't know that I would call it easy. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? You make funny beep sound. If we have the power to travel freely through time, can I just send the Sentinel back to before the war starts? Nope, that's impossible. We can't just jump around as far as we want. We can only travel 40 years at a time. Besides, this is as far back in the past as we can go. I see. That's unfortunate. I wanted to stop For the now, war. <laughs> let's find Shihiro. All right, let's go. Where are we even going, man? She's most likely at an evacuation shelter. If not, then I might find her at the Karabe's house. Move out. Half expecting I mean, it to cat to a black screen that just says we found nothing. Whoa. Uh, this might be worse. What the fuck are those? What's going on? Uh, those are those digging robots from the, the robot part deserted. of the game. The factory and station are both empty. Radios are down. No one's answering. Where is everyone? You see that? It's that creature. Okay, so that thing is an alien weapon, and it's here to invade Earth. The Sentinels were created to fight them off. 
She's that that is the most correct thing she said so far. <laughs> this is just like what happened in the city from the future. After the aliens invaded, everyone was gone. Wait. If people are disappearing in the past, what's happening to everyone in my era? I don't know. That's Oh, hey, it's Tom Tomoe, whatever her name is. Tomo. Oh, that's her name, right? The kaiju aren't secret US military weapons. They're alien invaders from the future. I I mean kind of. They are invaders from the future. And the sentinels are the tools we need to defeat them. Hello. Are you dead? What happened? Oh, she's alive. Title signs are failing. Condition is too critical for life support. Tamao-san, where's Shihiro? Shihiro, John, is... Tamao Karabe's flashback. Okay, what? A little flashback. Oh, fucking Goto just fucking grabbed her, I see. Goto-san, what are you doing? Let me go! Please calm down, Miss Morimura. Yeah. Chihiro-chan, where do you plan on taking her? Yeah. I apologize for what I've done to you, but you have no reason to worry. Yeah. Wait! Goto. Goto. The one who was giving you medicine. Uh. Tamahosan! What? What? Huh? She disappeared. Why did that happen? Universal control. What? Her. What? Does that mean the aliens got her? Probably. <laughs> what do you mean Why probably? Why would they do that? That everyone is being held there. Until this world comes to an end. I love that the ro I love that BJ is not even like trying to correct her either. <laughs> Surely the robot knows what's going on. Yes. Okay, I think that was the last keyword I needed though. Oh, right, I can check that before I get in. Let me see. Yeah, I've got all these keywords now, so I don't know what to do with that Chihiro. information. Oh, I guess if I go to the park again, then f f fuck boy would be there. He's the one who took Chihiro from me. He might be the same guy that Tamao-san gets her pills from. Okay. According to Natsun, a boy named Renya Goto attends school in this era. He can apparently travel through time too. And BJ said he's from 80 years in the future. He's from fucking further than that. And then Chihiro. Renya Goto. If he's in, then Chihiro. Renya, if he's, then Chihiro. Get it together, Kate. She's uh, Yeah, yeah, the, she's quite yes, I understand. Could he be at the school? I don't care what it takes. I'm going to find him, and I'm going to get Chihiro back. Let's go. Visiting my alma mater in Sakum Award, sunset. Cat is still here. Renya Goto is Natsuno-san's senpai. He also attends the school in 1985. And according to BJ... <laughs> Why'd you say it like that? He's according to BJ. To the future. <laughs> that scout unit is an alien from the future. At least the footage, he if it's real. Yeah, All yeah. I know I mean, I don't think he's at the athletic building. I'm going to wait for Megami to show up. Ah, I startled the cat off. Well, she's not showing up, so maybe he is at the athletics building. Oh, hi. Miyura-kun. Natsuno-san. Hi. What, uh, what's up? Renya Goto, he also attends, and the court he's from... 
Oh, I haven't I thought about a bunch of these either. It reminds the idea of Parallel worlds, According time travel. Has indeed been 40 years. According to d history, it's been 40 this years. This seem to be based on the era I'm from. The two aren't connected. Perhaps this isn't really time travel after all. What do you mean? What has been different enough that it, you don't think they're connected? Even if I do bring the I guess there's no big home. robots everywhere. That's true. That part is true, actually. How can I bring the ones I swore to protect? Huh. That's actually a good point. If the robots are already in the 40s and they fucked everything up, then why aren't there robots here? Don't worry about it. Alternate timeline. I, never, it's I mean, it is probably that. The kaiju aren't there and Thanks, but I'm fine. In fact, I came here to find Renya Goto, but I have no idea what he looks like or how he dresses. Could you point him out to me? That might be a little tough. Goto Senpai has him in back on campus. I asked around and no teacher knows where he lives. Well, that's a problem. <sighs> Hello. Oh, Natsuno chan. Miwako. Done with practice already? Oh. Help me, Miwako. Goto Senpai, right? He took when he wasn't looking. Sorry. No, drag her ass, but it? but also help, please. Yeah. I need to go beat up a tall yes, nerd. This is it. Look, I've got a picture of Goto Senpai. She printed it off? Pardon my interruption. He's the tall guy in the back. This here is Renya Goto? The one with the glasses? Yep, that's him. Thanks, Miwako. <sighs> well, anyway. Where am I going? I'm thinking. How could this be? How could this be? The man I saw at the park was Renya Goto. Yeah. The bastard who kidnapped Chihiro. No. Not that. Anyway. <laughs> Bye, ladies. I'm busy. My revenge waits for no one. 1600 hours heading to no Ayame Pass. That the timeline of these little these little things that we do is unclear to me also. Cuz this part happened, I guess. I hope they give us like a timeline. Like a big timeline at the end. Yeah. It really is you, isn't it? Please say something. Uh -uh. Give her the stuffed rabbit. Give her the stuffed rabbit. Stuffed rabbit. I found this. It survived the air raid. I meant to give it back to you earlier. This is your favorite stuffed animal, isn't it? Big, big brother. Don't lose it again. All right. I won't. You. It really is you. I'm so relieved you're safe. I suppose it's true. Huh? What? It's not like my memories were displaced. My blissful dependency is your little sister. It's become part of my identity. Denial can cause enormous strain to one's psyche. Shihiro? Are you okay? Better than okay. I've regained my original memories. I'm Chihiro Morimura. Morimura? You're the one who insisted on keeping that a secret. <laughs> Yet you gave it away in the end. It's you. Sometimes a bold change in plans is necessary. You'd know that better than anyone. Wouldn't you, Goto-kun? What, uh... I didn't he seems to mad. See you Renya Goto. What the hell did you do to Chihiro? Sigh. <laughs> I don't appreciate the hostility. You did. From his perspective, you kidnapped his sister, dog. What do you mean? But what you see here is Chihiro in her original state. She was never your little sister to begin with. Shut up. I'm not listening to a word you say. I won't forgive you. And I will avenge Tamao-san. I believe you misunderstand the situation. 
Chihiro, listen to your big brother and come with me. We're going. Where exactly? Back to 1945 where no one's left? Don't you see? It doesn't matter where we run. <laughs> if we have any hopes of preventing the loop, we need to prioritize gaining control over all systems. You've always been the dependable type. You used to be an excellent design engineer. What are you talking about? I'll always be on your side, Chihiro. That's what you told me, remember? So please, cooperate. <sighs> this poor fucking guy. <laughs> Is everything prepared, Goto-kun? Not what, having a good time. What, what a day he's having. Already. Good. Then I shouldn't waste any more time. Let's hurry. Chihiro! Don't even bother. Get out of my way. Chihiro is coming with me. She's being targeted for assassination. <laughs> and I highly doubt you have the capacity to protect her. What? Who would... Hey, Sekigahara. Should you decide to cooperate, let me know. <sighs> who? Sekigahara. I know who that is. Did he travel through time too? I think he's maybe from a different dimension, actually, as I yeah. recall. Is that how he got here? Which maybe that is time travel. I don't fucking know. Flashback. Sakura National School. Wooden building. 1944. Tamao-san. The military police are gone for now. How are things looking? They're searching for Kiriko-san. I can't believe she's a spy. They seem to think she's associated with him. He must have dragged her into this. I just don't understand. Why protect a wanted man? I'm all a guy. <sighs> that woman... Her name isn't Kiriko Doji, and she doesn't come from this world. You're a lunatic. I don't get it. What could she want with the Sentinel? You know about the Sentinel? You really are a spy. If she were to try and escape, she'd likely use the gate. If we leave now, we might be able to catch up to her. Saiki Gahara-san, please. I have to know the truth. I was told that my parents aren't really my parents. Yeah. And that I was brought here from the future. Yes, also true. Is that what Kiriko Doji told you? I don't know why she'd lie, but... See you tomorrow, but now she's here. I think that explains Awkward. the dreams I keep having. She's tampered with your memories. Uh. He's out of his mind. Don't listen to a word he says to Mao-san. We should just turn him in. Keitaro-san, please. I don't want it to come to that. Keitaro? As in Keitaro Miura? How the hell do you know my name? Hmm. I see. So it's you. What are you on about now? You and I have been fighting alongside each other. I've never seen you before in my life. The Miura of this era hasn't. The Miura of the future has. The future? Yes. He no longer has his physical body. What? His consciousness what? is currently stored inside a scout unit. What? Then BJ? Huh? Is... One and the same. <sighs> I've had enough of this nonsense. You, come with me. I'm taking you in. Taking you in where? Don't move. <gasps> Future gun. Sekigahara-san. You bastard. Like you said, I'm out of my mind. Poison is coursing through my brain as we speak. What? <laughs> okay, bye. What? What? Explain. <laughs> Explain. Wait, a missing memory event. Well, we haven't done that. Can't do that. Can't do that. Escape failed. Do we need something in particular for this? Doesn't say that you do. Oh, right. We never talked to Juro. We saw him, but we never talked to him. So that's probably the third thing here. All right. All right. I guess what... The League of Darkness. I forgot about that. 
Majora's around here someplace, right? Is that the other bully guy? It's he's to yeah. the left. Ogata-kun, what are you doing? Osami-chan, you trying to pick on Iori now? Please, Kisaragi. Just relax for a sec. What? I'm begging you here. <sighs> Alright, we did see her on the train. You know anything about a key? I mean the key. You told me something like I used to carry this key, right? Ogata-kun. I'm really not sure I follow. Ah, damn it. I gotta figure out how to say this right. That's unfortunate that they put... Uh, I did not, Molaga, because Boko's been streaming all week, and I can't stream while she streams. Okay, so That's fine. I'm working all next week. To tell me soon. Nice. You mm. know what I'm saying, right? I just want to know what it all means. I really don't know what you're talking about. Oh, here comes the train. This shit's so hard to explain. Um, what do you mean? The League of Darkness. League of Darkness. So you know the League of Darkness, right? Okay. What's your connection to that black cat suit lady? League of Darkness? What are you talking about? Damn it, I sound like a total loon. Yeah, a little yeah. bit, man. Yeah. leaving soon. Let's go, That League? She said something. She said I would, but none of them can't figure that... Believe it is. How do I? Where the hell? I feel like I still know. Aha! You missed your train, idiot. Probably. Hey, you don't look so good. You know anything about a key? Hey, keys are. Oh, I... Yes. <laughs> Where's Juro? Juro? No, that's those dipshit guys. That's not Juro at all. Juro! Juro, where'd you go? Oh, hello. You weren't here before. Hey, it's Shinonome-senpai. You're here too? Shinonome-senpai. You know anything about a key? Senpai, you don't have some kind of key on you, right? Though I guess it's not really a normal key. Probably. Man, how do I say this? How are you so bad at this? Do you know anything about the League of Darkness? <laughs> Yeah, a uh, key. Shouldn't we call someone over? Someone like who? Like a station worker? Uh, waste of time. Why is that? It's just gonna throw us back to the beginning. Hey, what's <laughs> going on with you? Senpai. Are you okay? I have to go. No. No. Oh, you don't. Something's up. Gotta get in. Hey, that's the wrong train. No, I hold on. One second. Tsutsuji bound local train car. It doesn't matter. We never make it out in time. We only got a couple. Even if I told someone. To... Where'd she go? Oh, she's collapsed. Oh, hey. A's here, too. Hey, Sekigahara. What's up? She don't know my senpai. Are you okay? Must have been her symptoms again. Looks like she passed out. Hey there, fellas. Did somebody mention the League of Darkness? <laughs> this guy, too. I know him. It's Sekigahara from back in the ruined city. Why is he with her? Why are they both knocked out? And they're just real tired. Here? Something in his hand. DD426. Uh oh, guy it's this guy. Hello, it's future man. That's poison. Hi. Yes. It was meant to poison the D forces. They ended up as collateral damage. The D forces. What are you talking about, old man? It sounds like you know about Shinonome Kun's condition, so you should already understand. The symptoms she endures come from that poison. Their what? nano machines are infected. They're beyond saving. But even with all their sacrifices, they cannot stop the D forces attack. Okay. You keep talking about these D guys. That's all the big mecha kaiju, right? A living apocalypse. Born in our Whoa, future, look at his fucking glasses. Time to destroy us. It all comes down to 15 teenagers, the commanders of the D forces. Ninji Ogatakun. It is a curse. 
One we cannot escape. Who are you? D command. Where's all this weird shit coming from? Who even are you? It doesn't matter anymore. I'm just a man in the past now. But it was never the kaiju. The problem. The true blot on this world was always the D-Force's creator. Who? It's us. Oh. Mankind was the cancer all along. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. Mankind is the real monster. Man. I found her out cold. Sounded like the poison got to her. Poison? A guy named Seki Gahara was knocked out too. That got anything to do with your key? I think I get what's going on here. The ghost you don't match up with my information. It's definitely someone else. When you see this key, well, no matter what it looks like, you should know it's the key. What's going on in that train? Something's not right there. When I'm inside the train, things always seem messed up. Hey. It's the they. Tsukasa Okino. It's the they. Hey, spotted. Oh, got a story 50% cleared. Oh, I can keep going with him, too. Cool. Well, let's carry on then, shall we? I thought Man was the most dangerous game. Man. Man can be multiple things. Maybe you've got a point. I should slow down and think a little. All right, I get it. Just don't move from here. Not one step. Don't move. What the hell, Pop? You think you can talk to me like that? <sighs> I want to ask you something. If you knew the world was going to end in a couple of minutes, how would you spend them? Uh, where's all this coming from? I just want to know how you feel. Well, a few minutes, huh? That's not a lot of time. It is not. Well, uh, I can't really get anywhere in a few minutes. So, I guess I spend them with you. I'll just be a second. I just need you to wait here for me. That okay? Uh, fine. Oh, that was cute. Hey, you! Oh, well, fuck good. boy. Well, fuck well, they. Fun. Out of my way. Fuck them. <laughs> <laughs> I love that he's at this point, like, done being polite, too. He's like, I don't care. We're moving on. Hey, hey, you! Weird voice. Okino, okay, you're the one. I saw you, you asshole. Oh, what are you talking about? Drop the act. How'd you put me in that capsule? Why do you keep putting me back here? I really have no idea what you're saying. Bullshit, you don't. He. We got two ways to do this, kid. Either you talk, or I make you talk. I. Uh. We got two. I... I saw that person trying to order me a rent. I only caught a. F it's that guy. You fucking get the fuck back here. You can run? Oh, he's mad. I think eventually I too would be upset in a time loop. Oh, you know, you asshole. What's going on here? Can he see me? I'm on to you, bastard. Get me out of this capsule thing. Capsule? Oh, hey, it's you also. You're the... Now I remember. Hijiyama. You came out of nowhere with that sucker punch. I gave you a warning. Don't act like I pulled some low-down trick. It's not my fault if you can't take a punch. You son of a... He seems upset. Whoa. Oh. Well, he's awake. What do we do now? Don't worry about it. We're not done yet. Where am I? What's going on here? You don't have to know. 
You're going right back in. Where? What? Come on! I don't even know what's happening. Okay, now you said you'd help us, right? Then you gotta do something before the attack hits. Can't you save any of the others? An attack? Wait, you mean those things are the true foes of the Sentinels? Exactly. What I need to find is the reason for the attack. So now we're here, trying to find the key that controls the D-forces. What? That doesn't help me at all. One person's commanding these kaiju to come here, right? One out of these 15 people? So you knew, yes. 15 children's lives were manipulated so that they would destroy the world. They broadcast command signals from their body. Even if they don't want to, or don't even know, those signals create the kaiju, and then beckon them here. Like the old guy was saying. So, are there lots of keys? No, just one. Out of all 15, only one has the key that controls them. Hmm. The League of Darkness. That League of Darkness lady said something about this. She said I was the one who had the key first. But I don't know anything about that. I don't remember anything anyway. Of course you don't. The control key is a code for a program. You're one of those 15 people. Up until two months ago, the commands were coming from you. Huh? Seriously? What? It was me? It used to be. Now though, well, from what I hear, that had already changed by the time we caught you. Now another person's got the key. And they're the ones sending out the signal to start an apocalypse. Hmm. Key? Okay, so this key is actually a program. How do you even look for something like that? Well, to you, it'll look like a standard metal key. At least within that station. What do you mean? I need to see who got the control key after you. The idea was to just pull the data out of you, but whatever happened is really bound up in your personal memories. I mean, Kisaragi showed us an actual physical key. Which means you're the only one who can dig that information out. That's why you're in the chair, and I'm on the tech side. I'm making it so you can find that key for me. Hold on a sec. You're telling me that whole station's... You've been in this chair this whole time. That station is an illusion created from your memories. You gotta be kidding. All in my head. I see now. That's how you broke out of the simulation. Even I'm there at the station. You piggybacked on my access ID. I guess that'd get you clear of control. Well, I can fix that right now. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, now we're all on the same page. So, let's jump back in. Uh, hey, hold on! Don't squirm, trust me. You don't want that tech coming off by force. You might never wake up. <sighs> Find the key. My apologies for hitting you. But you need to take this seriously. If you want to be free, help us. That's your only option. Please don't hit me again. <laughs> I was kind of expecting him to. <laughs> I was sort of expecting to hit him again. Okay. There's a lot of stuff locked behind that one now. Oh, hey, we did this. Neat. We found victims of poison. Oh, yeah. Okay, victims of poison were the two people on the train. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Man, we haven't been to this guy in a while. I think the last thing we saw him do was beat people up over Yakisoba Pond. Well, this is it, all right. No, He's also from the 40s, I from think. The school, I remember. Yep. Supposedly. Suppo allegedly. So he was just playing the part of Kiriko Doji. I don't know what he's up to, but if I help him, I can save our homeland from this war. I just have the 80s punk pompadour? Well, because he's from the 80s, my guy, and he's a punk. Sneak in. Now, I don't know if he's here or not. Still, I should go around the back. Keep a low profile. And we have seen them out back at least once. Oh, this back. This building had just been finished when I knew it. Now, well, it's certainly seen better days. Is Ichiban's voice actor also? Good old KG Tang. Like just yesterday, 
I walked these very halls to pick up Keitaro. And now, four decades have passed in a blink of an eye. Like a fairy tale. Whammon. And this young lady would be? Oh, that's Kiriko-chan. She came to us from Tokyo. I'm Kiriko Doji. Well, I miss your... You're stunning. M my name is Takatoshi Hijiyama. I'm going to remember this day forever. Because it was the day you came into my life. Did he say this at the time? You're a funny guy. But you seem pretty incredible yourself, Takatoshi-san. Uh, no. <laughs> I don't know about that. So what's got you all bashful and smiley in here? Kiriko-san. I mean, Okino. You really are a funny guy. Um, you keep saying that. <laughs> so the Sentinel's a weapon from the future? It's strange to say, but it does make sense. After all, even one of its computers was so Computor. far You could have just taken a nap at my place. I didn't think you'd come running after me. I'm not about to let you get away from me. I showed you my hideout. <laughs> it's like, to I told now. I told you where I live. Why would I run? <laughs> Still don't trust me, huh? I want to know everything about what you're trying to accomplish. I see. Well, fair enough. The question is, are you even going to believe me? I have already learned for myself that time travel is real. At this point, nothing surprises me anymore. Oh yeah? No more secrets. What are you trying to do? I'm trying to stop the apocalypse. A force is already on its way here to destroy the world, and they've got more numbers on their side than we'll ever have. What are they? I'm not really concerned with what they are. What I want to know is, why are they coming? The answer Probably because they got jerked. The <laughs> Jorking the new. <laughs> Jorking my peanuts. Let me try That's how they make peanut butter. <laughs> There are other humans with modifications, like you and Murakun, and they're beaming out these signals calling the destroyers here, even though they have no idea. The other threat you said the Sentinels were meant to fight. Are you saying it's them? These destroyers? They're a huge threat, all right. And these people with modifications, like me, they're calling them here? But weren't those implants only added so we could pilot the Sentinels in the first place? Well, I made the Sentinels, sure. But I'm not the one who modified all of you. There's too many unknowns with the Inner Lossiter. That's what I'm looking into. Inner Lossiter. I love it when oh, they just know. don't understand things sometimes. Inner Lossiter. So this Inner Lossiter... It's like a little network of tiny machines. It has to be implanted into your body. So what do you want me to do now? Everybody's supposed to be in class right now. You'll stick out if you're on school grounds. We can't have you wandering around where staff can see you. It'd definitely be a liability for me, at least. There'll be more of a crowd when lunch period rolls around. Until then, you should hang out here. A few hours later. I'm tired of hanging out around here. Sleeping face down on a school desk can't be good for my neck. <laughs> okay now. No, nor your spine. It's quite bad for both, actually. He told me to wait until noon. I can only waste time napping for so long. Noodles stir for I don't try, but if there's one ex I need some knock. I need some yaki soba bon. It's quiet outside. Maybe everyone's still in their classes. I'm trying to avoid being seen here, so I'm not supposed to go outside. But, <laughs> <sighs> but I'm hungry. <laughs> this fucking movie pitch, excellent. Hmm. Okay. Uh, 
Jason Momoa and Dave Bautista are working on together on a buddy cop film, which they intend to star in, said Momoa. Bautista texted me going, we need to do a buddy cop film in Hawaii. And I said, I have an idea. So it's off to the races now. Momoa went on to say, it sells itself, bro. Dave loves wearing Speedos. I love wearing board shorts and both of us with our shirts off. He'll be grumpy and I'll be charming. I'll have the hair. He doesn't have hair. We cover all the Democrats. <laughs> He's right, though. <laughs> He's right, you know. Come on, Takatoshi. You can't just let Okino tell you what to do. I can't wait any longer. Why don't get spotted fucking instantly? And then that means the dream is... Really? Oh, shit. Hey, kids. Uh, Hello, fellow hello? kids. Excuse me? Oh, I'm sorry. Did you want to chat? No. Look at his fucking dog. They're just talking, dog. They're talking. You don't have Maybe to you anything. really are from the 40s. Cute, I suppose, but clearly she has no eye for men. <laughs> True. Can I talk to them? No, they just ignore. They just no. Who just go? Uh. Mm. Break so area. Basically. I think I've seen me here before. I don't have any money. Sad. He's just like Ichiban. All right. I guess there's nothing here. Let's go to the schoolyard. Hi, Zyber. Spaghetti. It super is, though. You think so? Even Iori knows. Hmm. By the way, you know Nenji kun? He got a letter asking to see him after school. What, for a sunset showdown? That's yeah. so old school. No, no, it was a love letter. Ooh. Oh, this stuff again? You sure love your romance gossip. It's not like that. Hi. Why she... did you see him? That boy was so cool. Was, was... he? <laughs> I agree. Was cool, oh, wow. I was about to say the same exact thing. There. That has to be. <sighs> Quick, hide behind that kid. <laughs> Let me use, the... use that right guy as camouflage. <laughs> Can't get spotted now. I have walked five feet away. She looks at me again now. I don't have a guy to hide behind this side. Uh, let's go to the break area. I did see Okino here at one point. Where are they? Ugh, I'm dying. Where are they? Rip. Well, they're not there. That's... You the one? Said you'd be waiting here around now. Even stuffed a letter in my shoe locker, right? Yes. Shit, she's cute. Okay, so, uh, what's this about? Um... I like you. Uh, seriously? You? Me? Yes. Kizaragi's bullshit was starting to get to me. Maybe I'm kind of a stud after all. <laughs> no. What? No. Kiriko-san. That rat bastard. You don't go for girl. Oh, this is the sucker punch. Huh? What's your problem? Hey, put him up! Uh, hold on! <laughs> the mouth doesn't wait. Uh, wow, he did sucker punch him. You fucking I dumbass. You, this is. I mean. Don't tell me. You were jealous. Yes. I. Of course not. 
Were you gonna carry him back now, dumbass? I'm sorry for hitting him. You can apologize to him, not you like. <laughs> it's none of my business. Where's this coming from? You think I like him just because he's a guy? Uh -huh. Actually, you couldn't have picked a better time. This works. Ninji Ogata secured, despite complications. <laughs> I was just gonna seduce him, but this is also fine, I guess. <laughs> Here, tie him up and put him in a chair. <laughs> we'll put a weird thing on his head. False pretenses or not, that confession really got to him. Even knocked out, he's still blushing. I was also about to say I something about that. For him. You're, you're, you should feel bad. You sucker punched him for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> so he's implanted with the same technology as me? He's going to destroy the world? He's sending signals to the things that will. At least I thought he was. Something's <gasps> off. Ninji Ogata. Did we beat his ass for no reason? Signal. Looks like the decode signature has been changed. Yeah, we talked about this already. They it was in him and now it's not. That's why they kidnapped him and put him in a chair. That's bad. Now I'm gonna have to check everyone's chair. individual codes. More work I don't need. Sentinel. Don't we have the Sentinels? You said you created them to save us all. That's right, but we've already thrown 19 Sentinels at them and lost. Ugh. We need a bigger game changer than one or two Sentinels. That alone's not gonna make a difference. You did your homework on the Pacific War. You get it, right? When you're up against numbers like these, what can you do? <sighs> the Sentinels are meant to be a last line of defense. There, we've got a clue. Oh, I just had to walk away, but I guess. I can't access it from this side. He might be the only one who can. So, where does that leave us? Well, you see, we're gonna stick him in a chair, strap a thing to his face, and then, uh, <sighs> make him time loop. Morning, Hijiyama-kun. Why? Okino. Why am I in a chair? What's going on? Figure I out how it works Ninji first. Ogata. He didn't have anything for me. But I took a look at your code, and I have to say it's been very thought-provoking. Untie me this instant, or I swear, I'll... Yo, what? Why are you getting so worked up now? This isn't all that different from the old days in the factory lab. Just the two of us, enjoying some quality time, right? What? Even if that's partially true, things are different now. Untie me, before I really get angry. Well, that's weird. You sound like you're mad, but these numbers don't lie. You're actually kind of in this aren't you? <laughs> You see, I've got some math that proves you're horny right Being now. all tied up at the mercy of your crush. You're such a perv, Hijiyama-kun. Wow. Stop toying with me! Well, why don't we see what's really in your heart? What the... Blood, wow. Let's get it out of there. You really can't stop thinking about me, huh? Don't be ridiculous. I get it. You're lying to yourself. All to protect your self-image, right? But you can hide all you want. Your physical data gives it away. Don't lie to me! Fine. Why don't we take a deeper look? Stop. Wow. This really says Stop it all. Stop it! Stop, please! And they're just Damn. bullying him. <laughs> that is kind of just mean. <laughs> that was a mean thing they did. Is there anything else here? Nope. No. Yeah, that was only his sec first chapter. Yeah, man. Mm. All right, well, we haven't done one of these in the whole stream. We got about half an hour left. That's usually how long it takes me. Brain overload. Okay, Mira has to be on the team. Is that possible? Which one is Mira again? Oh, boy. I don't know, man. Ah, this one's Mira. So he has to be on the team. City defense rate uh, time of clearing 70% or higher. What is our what's the what's the game plan look like? Does it say? Game Shield? plan is win. Mm. 
Shield Apsos Kaiju will appear. I probably don't need to bring all four of these G4s. I'll participate. Oh, I took him off the team. Hold on. Oh, I've only got four on the team right now. I see. Let's bring you. And let's see. If they got shield ones, I should probably have something with EMPs. Do I have anything with EMPs? Any of you guys got EMPs? Let's see, Sekigahara's got EMP. I'll fight. Sorry. I push myself too hard. Okay, so I need to take I need to bring Miura. So let's we'll start there. Now I need to fix five more of these bitches. No problem. EMP stunner, good, good. Not a problem. My turn. Uh, no MP there, but probably helpful regardless. Ready. You, I know, had one. Let's go. The invasion ends here. And you two need one more. One I'll flight support, fight. one shield monkey. Did I'll none fight. of you motherfuckers have EMPs? We'll take leg spike. I guess that's fine. At forty-seven thousand to spend, eh? Can I upgrade the meta system? I can. I can upgrade it to level six. It unlocks more upgrades. Summons four Type ninety-eight bipeds. What is? What? What does that mean? Go target for eight seconds. Who am I bringing again? You... Okay, so what can I do here? Drops aerial kaiju, distracts kaiju. Defense mode. Shifts into defense mode. Move speed drops to one-third, but durability quadruples. Whoa, did you see its titties get bigger in that preview? That's crazy. Did its titties get bigger? <laughs> <laughs> I've seen this photo set before. Access denied? What do you mean access denied? Yeah, I'll get a counter. Why not? Equip that shit. Okay, Sekigahara's coming. Can I upgrade any of his shit? Heavy damage, ignores armor. Let's enhance those defensive flares. Cooling device. Plastic arc fusion cutter. Nor's armor and slot oh, requires level ten though. I don't have that. It's great upgrade sentry gun. Upgrade rocket launchers. Who else is coming? Mira's coming. Upgrade railgun. Doesn't hurt. Super large missile. Upgrade mega railgun. Don't mind if I do. Upgrade anti-air. That's always good. What do you got? You've also got a railgun. Ah, this stuff is too high level. A modified condenser allows for two consecutive railgun shots. That's pretty good. I think I am going to want that. I can't get it right now, but I do want it later. No, just I wish there were just like a suggestion button, honestly, because there's so much shit. Yeah, right? Counter on you. Fires convergent laser beams directly forward. Some sentinel ignores armor. Yeah, I'll get that. 
I'll get that and I'll upgrade it twice. And we'll upgrade Leg Spike too while we're here. Alright, that's probably good. The MP itself didn't say anything about doing that. I was just sort of hoping it did. That said, you'd be better off destroying them before they get the shields up at all. Activate Aegis or destroy all kaiju, lost condition, terminal destroyed, or any pilot killed. I'll stop what's the plan. Don't let up. Let's get in there. Okay, these are all. Well, we'll just do this. I don't think so. How do I... Which one of you is the sentry gun? We'll do sentry gun over there. Where are they? G3s are the snipers, right? Yes. I have two different rail guns. Heavy railgun, mega railgun. And I guess I'll use the mega, right? Me. Yeah. Bang, bang. I would never not. Got him. They're not making it through that into air. Let's hope so. Alright, G1, so you're one of my melee boys. I'm gonna need Number you to start 11. getting in there. Okay, there's another shield boy in there. Oh, I can if I move it changes the center of the MP. Did that do it? Neutralized. No fight I can't win. Get rest. Now that. That ought to do it. Stay calm. Remember your training. Number 19. Unbelievable. Commence the magic like an amateur. Okay, where is this dropping exactly? Like over here? Number 12, moving out. Not throwing away the practice rounds. How do I? I just need people to be generally closer. Moving out. Oh, the counter is passive ability. Excellent. Yeah. Nice. Anti -air More anti air. Do I have anything I can prep? Not really. I mean, I guess I could prep more anti air. Oh, there are still some guys that are not dead, in th which case I should uh, take care of that. Come on. Good. Done. <laughs> Let's get him. I think the big laser just took care of them, actually. <laughs> Oh, they're dropping behind us. That's no good. Number 15, moving out. 
What's happening over here? Oh, shit. <laughs> Um, let's see here. Multi-lock missiles is this one, right? Yeah, let's, uh... Let's start getting you in there. Actually, can I put up more than one sentry gun? I'll throw this one in the river so it's not in anyone's way. Let's see. Leap! Okay, these guys have not finished dropping yet. So let's just get you in a little bit closer. anyone to hit here yet. Oh, yep, they just got here. Okay. These are all... Oh, no. A lot of those guys. Okay, let's leap attack, shall we? Just take out as many of them as possible. Yeet! Did that, do it? that did not do as much damage as I was hoping. Railgun, help! Railgun, I've put myself in a situation I no longer want to be in. Okay, that's better. Okay, I can't hit this these aerial. Oh, there's a shield one in there. Well, let's take care of that. Okay, this air bitch is still going. Let's leg spike it. Okay. What if I just EMP all of these guys? Did that do it? Next. The practice round's over. It is very difficult to see in this situation I've created for myself. Yeah. There's so much shit going on here. I can't really tell what's what. Yeah, because I can't attack any of these airborne guys at all. Bonk. <laughs> Okay. Those guys are stunned, so I'm not as worried about them. Okay, there are three enemies over here, basically, but I want to hit the big one. Did I get it? Enemy signal terminated. How was okay. that? Let's do this. I'm going to leg spike the big one again. It's almost dead. All right, where's the... There's more, another one dropping over there. I need to get it closer. Right, Railgun, what can I hit? Those guys are still stunned, so I'm probably fine there. The big boy's dead over there, so yeah, I should probably just forget these guys. I can hit three of them. I don't know what this does. I keep forgetting this is a thing I have. I never use these meta skills. I always forget that they're here. Yeah? If I use them, does it do anything bad? Oh, I can just deploy guys. Well... Don't let up. Okay, well, who's over here? G Molar, G Mo and I fucking hate these twin tails. Let's get them. <laughs> Can I hit them both? Me at fucking me at Hatsune Miku, I guess. What a bitch! That's her best. The best feature is twin tails. What actions do I have for you? Oh, I do have heavy knuckles. Excellent.
What did my dropping four dudes over here look like? Where are that? Where are my dudes? Where are the dudes I dropped? I don't actually see any dudes. I sent dudes, but I don't see any dudes. Oh, here they are, I think. Okay, what's still left over here? Uh, nothing. Nothing that I can hit. So we're just gonna move over. into the... Number 12, moving I guess life comes at you fast. Unbelievable. The practice round's over. I can't hit these airborne bitches. I have an idea. Oh, a bunch of my air anti air is gone. It finally wore off. Okay, who do we got? How's the sentinel? Who do we got? Who do we got? Oh, there's a tall boy there. Tall boy, some twin tails, G molar. They didn't put a shield guy in this group. Okay. I mean, I guess I'm not complaining. I'm genuinely surprised they didn't put a shield guy in this little group of guys. That sort hey, of what seemed, you can get. Sort of seemed like the whole thing, didn't it? What's the plan? I don't think my rush attack is going to get me even close, like near close enough. I just need you to start getting in there, Mira. Or, uh, Sekigahara. Mira is this one. Oh, hey, I've got Railgun. They're, like, just at the edge of my Railgun range. Is that the large Railgun? Yeah, let's just, just at the edge of well, the range means it was in range. Yeah, we'll go with the Mega. That seems wise. Oh, is there another... Is there more dropping in? Where? What? No, stop. Stop. Stop it. Number 15, all pretty freaky. Oh, hey, I've got full, full AP. How'd that happen? Or MP, whatever the fucking unit of measurement is. I need my magic points to use my fucking robot. <laughs> EP, that's what it's called. Oh, your EP? Leap attack! I don't have enough for a leg spike. That's unfortunate. I can get all of these missiles, though. Demolisher Blade ignores armor. We'll do that from this angle because that's going to... It's activating an attack. Oh, it's dead. I think I'm getting better at this. And you know what? If I look in the lower right there, I do have an MP stat. So I who knows what that means? That's the meta points or something. Nice. All units fighting the kaiju. Can you hear me? Hi? Who's that? No. How'd you get on this channel? Wait, here is a girl Miwako was helping. Chihiro? Is that you, Chihiro? I'm Chihiro Morimura. What? That's our teacher's name. I'm going to evacuate the populace all at once. Readout say 1.2 million people in Sector 4. They'll all be four shifted to the year 2025. Wait a second, that's next year. You're shifting over a million people? So you don't have to worry about any civilian casualties. That's all. Chihiro. Oh, wait a minute. Nope. <laughs> Already doing it. Zoop. I banish you all to 2025. Goodbye. <laughs> I want to go to 2025. And yet you will. Seki Gahara MVP. 
Takahoshi Hijiyama, learned, learned Patriot. We got one mystery point. Rank S, five stars, baby. We got the side objectives. We got stuffed rabbit. Got two mystery points. No. I always hit the wrong button and it's like, hey, you wanted to make the game harder, right? Yeah. That's what you wanted? All right, what should we spend our mystery points on? The League of Darkness. League of Darkness. Come on. Darkness. Evil organ of what, what the fuck? That appeared in Common Heroes Stranger, a TV show that Nenji Ogata was obsessed with in second grade. Focused on destroying human society and nature with chief evil at the helm. Incredible name. They consisted of the machine people, humans that were turned into cyborgs and other nefarious forces of darkness. Incredible. Mighty Kaiju Daimos. Definitely not Godzilla. It's different. 2025 canned soda. You know what, sure. Valkyrie. Canned soda that Nejigata found for Tomi Kisaragi in the 2025 ruins. No matter how tired you are, one sip of this energy drink will recharge you instantly. Cool. Alright, I think that's gonna have to do it for us tonight. I don't think I can accomplish anything else in eight minutes. So. Yeah. We made some good mystery progress, I think. The, the plot is starting to come together for me. Uh, so thanks for watching, everybody. Have a good night, and we'll catch you tomorrow for, well, I'll probably stream at some point tomorrow, but uh, uh, not relevant, not scheduled. It'll be one of those underground streams. <laughs> well, Under have, underground. Have a good night. Bye-bye.